is Zaya and this is one of my 10 minute tech tutorials during which I share something tech. So either it's a tutorial about one particular aspect of something or I explain how you can solve an issue or I present you a tech tool that I love and that I recommend highly. So today, uh, oh, if you like them, please uh, like the video, like with the thumbs and everything. And please subscribe to my YouTube channel, which I'm trying to make more content for. So if you like them, please do help me out. So um, today I'm going to talk about Canva. I have a little trick that maybe you don't know on how to merge two documents, uh, because very often we create one document, we like it, but then we forgot about it and then we create another one. Um, which has a similar format, but then half of the information is in one and the other one is in the other and it's annoying. So how can you merge that easily? I'm going to show you right now. So um, I'm going to change tabs here and come here. So I have this document here um, that is my 2023. If you can see up the here, it says 2023 social Facebook group. Um, it's all my, my new post um, graphics. And uh, before I have also another one here. So as you can see, um, so we're going to group both of those and, and merge them. Sorry, not group. And there it's, it's actually really simple. So let's uh, stay on this one. I'm going to take my face out of the way. Um, so what I do is I go and I have a paying version of Canva, which I highly recommend. Um, you will find a link for an affiliate link for Canva um, at the bottom of the video. Um, but I think it works on the, what I'm going to share works on the free version as well. So what you have here in the left hand side is a column with various things. And you might note that you have a projects column. So if I find the projects column and if I go into my designs here and I will find the designs that I want to merge. So it's this one, right? And so we have six pages, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to create an extra page here. So I go at the bottom and I click plus. And there I have an extra page. It's a blank page, right? Uh, don't duplicate, just, you know, the little plus icon that will create an extra page. And then I'll just click on one of this and poof. And it can even, I can also add a page like this um, and I can apply all six pages, I think. Yes, voila. So all six pages have now been applied. The thing is, it has deleted the previous ones, which I don't want to do. So I'll go backwards here and here I'm again with just the one page. So if I apply all the pages, uh, to this document, it will make the new pages, dis the old pages disappear, which is not what I want. So I'm going to, sorry, uh, one of the things is I don't see what I'm doing when I don't have my glasses. So it's easier to just click on one image after the other, add another page and poof. And voila. So I now have a document that has all of my pages. Let me See if I can, oh gosh, this thing is in the middle. Um, I'm going to hide this just a minute. Let's see if I can move this. No, I can't. Okay, so I'm going to just show you like this. So you see I have my previous few images and here are the new ones that are coming from the other one. Obviously, the last thing uh, I need to do is go back into my general um, menu and destroy this one so that it doesn't exist anymore. So I'll move it to trash. Right. So we have um, here when I am on my uh, basic page, home page for Canva, if I choose a document like this one, uh, a design, sorry, if I click on the three little dots, I can move to trash and make it disappear. Um, and I will show you in, a, in, a, in another tutorial how to uh, organize a little bit your folders. But for now, this was a tutorial on how to, sorry, here, here it is, on how to merge two documents. Easy does it, you don't have to copy and paste. Now, if um, each element, I mean, now if the documents are not the same size, it's a little different. And I will discuss that some other time. But for now, 
uh, how to merge two documents that are, are two designs that have set different pages. That's easy and fun. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, again, um, like and subscribe to the channel. Bye for now.